Hi guys, I hope you're all well. Welcome back to another hairstyling review on this channel. Today I would like to talk about a brand that has been pretty popular on Instagram recently because they put out a lot of interesting content and a lot of inspirational hairstyling photography on their Instagram page. I'm talking about Black Label Grooming, which is UK based and they also have a couple of different products that I've been using for say half a year now and that has been a very interesting brand for me. So I thought that I might walk you through their product lineup and tell you what I think about three of their products. First off, there is a pre-styling spray called Black Mist. This is basically a sea salt spray that also adds a lot of texture and control to your hair. I basically love this spray because of its smell and because of the texture it gives me and especially because of the amount of control that I can achieve when I use this before I blow dry slash post style my hair. Uh, it will feel like a sea salt spray when you style your hair so there is definitely a little bit of tucking, tugging and pulling um, when you apply it before blow drying and when you use a a brush or a narrow toothed comb it's definitely going to yeah pull or tuck a little bit but the overall effect is that this gives you a lot of control over your hair while blow drying and after and even after blow drying when you apply a post styler also you're gonna get a lot of texture added on top of the post styler you will be using so say you use a light hair clay like dynamite clay by by Valane. Um, the hairstyle is going to look a lot more textured after using this as a pre-styler um, compared to if you don't use a pre-styler. So you're gonna see a lot of hair strands and it's going to give you a very nice depth and a very nice texture. Next up is one of their supposedly top selling products, at least if you believe the information on their website, which is Shape Paste. Shape Paste is a very thick hair paste that is kind of the big sister to American Crew Fiber um, with the only difference that this product actually works and provides excellent hold for your hairstyle. The finish is rather dry on first day hair and if you use it on second or third day hair it's gonna add a little bit of shine to your hair. Apart from that I found it suitable for more natural hairstyles with a lot of movement that don't really stick together that much. So if you're a guy who is looking for sweeping and natural hairstyles this is a product that you might be interested in. The final and one of my regular go-to products is Craft Clay. Craft Clay can be described best by a clay that is sticky as hell, but that also is probably the mattest hair clay that I have ever used. So this bad boy is even stickier than Hans de Foucault's Claymation. It's pretty tough to warm up and pretty tough to get out of the jar, but it provides excellent texture and is going to give you a 100% matte finish that I've never seen in any hair clay so far. The hold on this one is excellent. It's a really high hold product and you can layer your style as much as you want with it. So if you start out with a little bit, it's going to give you excellent hold and a little bit of texture and the more you add, the more texture will be added to your hair. But the good thing is that it's not going to weigh your hair down. So if you use a little bit too much, you're still left with a lot of hold and a lot of volume. One last thing I should say about these products is that they smell like lemon sherbet, which is a very sweet scent. Um, which I personally like, but just so you know, the smell is going to last quite some time. Like with the sea salt spray, um, it's going to last for like two to three hours 
um, if you use more of the product it's going to last maybe even longer so that's it so far I hope I was able to give you a decent impression of what these products look and feel like um, this is a brand that I've been using on a regular basis if I go for textured hairstyles um, with a lot of volume and a lot of holes. So if you want to check them out, I've put a link to their website and their Instagram account in the description box under this video. And if you like this video, just leave me a thumbs up or subscribe to this channel if you're new to this channel. And of course, if you have any questions regarding the products or other topics, just uh, write them down in the comment section. I will make sure to answer them as fast as possible. So thanks for your attention, guys. I will see you in the next video and bye-bye.